the scene of the Summer Olympics five years ago, the Bird's Nest Stadium this weekend hosted the Air & Style Beijing, a six-star event on the world snowboard calendar. Riders from all over in the running for a thousand points on the World Tour standings, as well as a share of the $100,000 prize money. As you can see behind me, the competitors have already started making practice jumps and we've already seen a few slips and falls. We can only expect a few more. The way the scoring is going to work is it's going to be a best of two in the first round and then best of three from there on all the way to the final. Whoever gets the best go out of the three chances they have, they crown the winners of Air and Style Beijing. And among them was one of the few Chinese riders currently on the World Tour circuit. Her way, apart from being the only Chinese rider competing here, was naturally the home favorite as well. But if there was any pressure from that, it wasn't showing on him. I feel very honored to participate. I think I'm very lucky. To me, there's not a lot of pressure there because it's more of a self-challenge. I've never experienced a platform like this before. I just want to compete with these riders and gain the experience. That's the most important thing. And compete he did, before eventually bowing out of the competition, but not before a huge cheer from the crowd. And the battle between the remaining riders saw a bit of everything. Some falls, some near misses, even a crash. He was unhurt and okay, by the way. There were also some jumps bordering on the fantastic. And it was ultimately the man from Sweden, Sven Torgren, who came out on top for a win he was particularly pleased with. It's just, yeah, it's just great. And this is one of my dreams since I was a kid. And uh, Aaron Style is just like the biggest contest. Yeah, I'm so happy. And just tell me one thing, what was the toughest challenge out there? Uh, to stick my tricks. Uh, the tricks that, I, that we do right now is pretty hard. And uh, usually I don't land them this often. So yeah, I'm really happy that I landed it. And uh, what about next year? Can we expect you back here? For sure, for sure. And when he returns to the Chinese capital, as will we, to see if the Swede can repeat moves like this next year as well. Aiden Barua, BOM.